हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन ए एंड्रॉइड लर्निंग सीरीज वी इन लास्ट लेक्चर वी हैव लर्न द यूज ऑफ ब्रॉडकास्ट रिसीवर टू चेक द वाईफाई कनेक्टिविटी हेयर वन मोर टॉपिक इन ब्रॉडकास्ट इज रिमेनिंग इज कॉल्ड कस्टम ब्रॉडकास्ट रिसीवर सो फॉर क्रिएटिंग ए कस्टम ब्रॉडकास्ट रिसीवर इज वेरी इजी सो फॉर दैट वॉट वी हैव टू डू वी हैव टू मेक वन मोर कस्टम एक्शन हेयर एंड्रॉयड नेम एनी नेम यू कैन गिव लाइक माई एंड्रॉयड ब्रॉडकास्ट my android broadcast okay any name you can give whatever you want i am giving here my and android broadcast then go to receiver same broadcast you have to register here same here you have to register intent filter intent filter dot add action then let's see here same you have to register here but problem in custom broadcast is that when it will fire because the predefined broadcast receivers fires on on particular time like we turn on the data then mobile is saying that mobile uh, mobile data is running when we put the charger it say that charger is run is connected power is on or off but here it's a custom the android does not does not know how and where this particular event will occur so we have to generate event also so how we can generate event we can generate event by click on, on a button so i just creating a button here when i will click on this button the event will fire and it will execute my broadcast receiver so i just connect this with this text box here and uh, by this corner also by this corner also okay and uh, i'm giving a name also this is btn show broadcast and uh, here also i am putting a name on the caption bar show broadcast show broadcast so if you see it will come here the show broadcast so when i will click on this button then my broadcast will fire so here i am creating the button object so broadcast this is my button so just we connect this button find view by id r dot id dot button then show broadcast dot set on click listener new on click listener okay here we will fire the broadcast so we have to give intent i equal to new intent then i dot set action and here we have to put the same action which we have entered earlier then we set send broadcast and here we have to pass i okay so this send broadcast function will execute this broadcast and here we have to check again so what broadcast is running so we can check here once again we can check here like this and here we can check what action is fire and that action is on my android broadcast so here and here we say my custom broadcast is fired okay 
and till now we i, I have to remove this connectivity uh, because it will execute automatically or i will show you with this also okay this way and if i run this program you will see this output here you see the program is running when i click on this button it say my custom broadcast is fired it also showing internet is running and custom broadcast is fired because internet is also connected by the mobile data so i click and it say my custom broadcast is fire so like this you have learned from the last previous three lectures how you can create broadcast receiver for power on and off and how you can use broadcast receiver for checking internet connection or wi-fi connection and the third lecture you also learn how you can create your custom broadcast so by last three videos you can learn each and everything about broadcast in android see you in remaining next video lectures till then bye